Here in North Carolina, agriculture and agribusiness are the lifeblood of many a region for several reasons. First, of course, there's the land. Rich and fertile, it's always given us what we need. Next is science. Through world-leading research, we learn how to improve on what Mother Nature has given us and apply that to the growing, the harvesting, and the processing of a cornucopia of products. Then there's the workforce, our people who have a love for this life, an appreciation for a tradition, and 21st century skills, many of which they learn just down the road at their local community college. North Carolina has 58 community colleges serving all 100 counties. Each school is dialed in and responsive to the workforce training needs of its community. So here, outside of the big cities. For many, the preferred coursework relates to agriculture and or agribusiness. Just for context, let's look at some numbers. In North Carolina, nearly three quarters of a million people work in agriculture and agribusiness, making it the state's largest industry. Generating over $87 billion of the annual gross state product, it represents one-sixth of the state's employees and income. Well, our line of business, we know we're helping feed the world and clothe the world. So that's satisfying to know that we're in a business that we're helping other people. With an impact like that, you can see why the community colleges offer a wide range of ag-related choices, and they're all pretty popular. I feel like attending here was a really good way to start getting my education, to learn more about animal science and agribusiness so that I could better figure out what I want to do with the rest of my life, what type of career setting I want to go into. We teach trainees how to grow crops and raise livestock, how to process as valuable commodities into marketable food products, and how to put food on the table, literally. In terms of direct skills training, we can guide students from farm to table. Anytime we can take locally sourced ingredients, put it together into a mighty nice product and do it safely and sell that resulting product in the local market, we have a win-win scenario for everyone. And there are dozens of support roles requiring skill sets that cover a broad spectrum. These too are skills that are taught in local community colleges and can apply anywhere, including in any food processing operation. The types of work that we have for people here are a lot of operations, jobs, quality, maintenance in particular. Trainees often use the skills they've learned for themselves. You'll find that entrepreneurs thrive here. Or they can, just as easily, use those skills for your company. Campbell Soup has 25 plus years of relationship with Robson Community College and it has been very effective over the years. If your company is in the market for a well-trained workforce, you've come to the right place. North Carolina has plenty of opportunity for companies that are looking for a new home. And we have the skills and training available here through our community college system to make sure that they have the people that they need to do the job that they want done. In the same way that North Carolina is conducive to crop and livestock growth, it's also fertile ground for new industry and innovative thinking. For instance, we're known around the world for sweet potatoes from our sand hills. But an award-winning vodka locally distilled from those same sweet potatoes has become the toast of the spirit world. Our sand hills region also makes North Carolina one of the world's largest exporters of blueberries and pork. And that region is home to the world's largest kenaf farm. Fairly new to these parts, kenaf is an ancient crop used for everything from clothing and paper making to water filtration. A new strain of tobacco has been developed exclusively for alternative energy production. Our peaches are second to none in quality, variety, and most importantly, in ice cream. From aquaculture to Christmas trees, row crops to restaurants, and turf grass to agritourism. Agribusiness in North Carolina is as modern and varied as the people who work in it. Today in North Carolina, there's a lot of uh, career opportunities in agriculture, agribusiness, and a big part of that is, is the boom in technology. When you walk through the door, people are smiling, they know each other and care about each other. What better way to spend your day than with family? Question. When someone special comes to visit, how do you show them that they're important to you? That you think highly of them or even love them? At our home, 
we try to make a really good meal for them. We use food as a way to convey caring. And this whole state, from the sand hills and coastal plain to the midlands and mountains, is doing that right now for you. It's like we're saying, welcome to our home. We're making something special for you. And we are. What's special is our workforce. The ingredients, well, you start with very special people. Then you add tradition, work ethic, experience, and training, especially the training programs of our community college system. Combine them all in a large, beautiful, business-friendly state, and voila, this recipe makes enough for your company and more. I invite the larger companies to come and look, where you have a good workforce, where you have good people, have good opportunities for employment, and available workforce too. So if you're looking for a home for your startup or expansion, you know what to do. Come and join our agribusiness family here in North Carolina. Contact us to find out how the nation's best trained agribusiness workforce can help your company grow toward prosperity.